coming down to the ring for this triple threat match. He's the third competitor in this main event match to decide who's going to be the number one contender for the Pools Wrestling Championship. Is it going to be Drake Edwards or is it going to be Bert O'Neill or the Gunslinger Matt Asadar? We are just about to find out our main event here today at Pulse. Any one of them would be a great challenge to Kingston Ellington, the price. But only one of them it will be. Which one will it be? That we are, we are going to find out who is going to be the challenger. <laughs> but don't forget, two weeks ago, Bert and Drake got into a verbal confrontation with the Pulse champion Kingston Ellington and now Nightfire, if you remember, if you remember that. I do. Uh, this led to a tag team match being made. And also late in that match, Kingston and Niall attacked Drake and Bird with chairs. And I think you still could see a chair laying around here somewhere that was used in that match. Matt Asada, though, came out to the ringside and cleared the ring, helping Drake and Bert. And then, last week, Matt challenged Kingston one more time. Kingston Ellington asked Matt to put his career on the line. The challenge was accepted. That's what the true cowboy does. Towards the end of the match, Niall has distracted the referee when Matt had Kingston down on the mat, ready for the 1-2-3. But Bert and Drake came to the ring, huh, came to the ringside and brought with Niall to the back. But Matt Asseter picked up the win, and now the BW chairman Stuart Worth we went to the ringside right after that match and was announcing that we're going to see a triple threat number one contenders match and you know what this is the match going on right here well Matt Asadar just went for the clothesline and Drake ducked it now Drake answers with a big boot of his own goes for a cover oh going straight for the pin oh, ho, 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 ho. no not so easy got a one two only a two count one count only a one count here comes the oh, Sonic look Roll! Here. Look at, look at Bert! Look at Bert. Oh! The Sonic Roll! Oh, and Drake was just getting out of the way for that. Here comes Drake. Oh, and he goes with the oh, burning my knee. Lord. King Kong knee drop. Go straight he for, goes for here, a cover. Though. Oh, my God. Uh, Only one, one no. Count. That's uh, the thing about a triple of threat moves. match. Yes, That's the thing. You can lose the match by not even getting pinned, so you have to watch out for that. And if you're going for a pin, the third one's liable to break it up anyway. Yeah, so you better make sure that the third person is not getting in the way. Hold on! Oh! Oh, they Double both Double drop hit. kick! Oh my! And they both, they both connected and they both nipped back up to a standing position. Nice! And now they're just kind of staring each other down which is giving the gunslinger Matt Azar a chance to regroup himself. And ladies and gentlemen, I just want to throw in a quick information that Pulse Wrestling is going to host in Invasion Revolution at the Epicenter... Hold on, what, what is it? It's the Epicenter in Empire City. It's just down the road. It's getting set up and ready for November 29th, 5 p.m. SLT, for uh, Pools Invasion Revolution. So we will send you uh, information on where to get there soon, so you can put it in your Google Maps. Oh, hold on, here we go. The match is still on the way. Nice corner exploder. There comes Smash. Big boot to the face. Oh, and he just floored Drake with that big boot after Drake oh, floored. straight for a big fall, so. Exploder, count of one, one, count of two. Two, and it on. So close to have seen a new, uh, a number one contender. You are seeing some very fast-paced action here right at VWE Pulse. Oh, my Lord, oh! that belly-to-belly -belly suplex from the gunslinger. Did you see the height that Drake Edwards hit from? Tossed him straight over head, perfectly executed belly-to-belly, -belly, and the strings advantage is definitely on the gunslinger side. But now he's picking Drake up right there, and Drake is still hearing the bells ring. Oh, my, hold on! Osaka cutter! Osaka cutter! Oh, he nailed it. Perfectly nailed it. Bert is smelling, is smelling trouble. 
Burt's oh, trying no, to get back Mitch. into the ring here. So he can break it up in case the gunslinger goes for a pin. Oh, oh my lord, he just hit with that flying forearm that just floored the gunslinger. Holy shit, did you see that? Did you see the height? He springboard right off that top rope. Flew halfway across the ring to deliver that flying forearm. And he caught the gunslinger with it. And now he's oh, going back on, up going for a for second it. time. Oh, moon salt. The Koopa Splash. The Koopa Splash. I don't do Drake. That and is the Koopa more, Splash. More insult to injury. Drake was already down, but he has to make sure that Drake and Matt are staying on the mat. Hold on. And a oh my lord. 180. 180 leg drop. For Bird three quarters of the way across the ring. Hold on, cover, cover, one, two, and a new contender, no! Oh, oh, oh so counts. close, so close. We almost saw Bert taking the number one contendership home to his kingdom. Who is going to be yes, the one to face did. the place? And you hear Bert saying, this is my level to win. I will face the boss, Kingston. He needs to turn around. Get some one-ups. Oh! Because he's in a bad spot right now after that Muay Thai kick for Drake. Oh, and a discus punch. And now Matt and Drake going at it. Firing kicks. Oh, is it going to drop? Oh, here it comes. Oh, my Lord. Now the now the cravat knees right to the face. Oh, it ah. just a kick, that series of kicks that just dropped him like a sack of taters. These educated feet are being put to good use. Drake is very quick with those feet of his. Ah, oh, there goes Drake into the ropes, coming back for the ah, oh! standing shining black. Here he comes. He going to do now he came in from the ropes oh and another one he went to the well a second time and hit with it ah a third kick one him. kicks him straight into the face going for a pin no 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 oh no 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 that was only, only a two count Matt Asada was able to kick out of that one even though he almost got his head kicked off and Berto O'Neill is back on his feet Drake is so too. Oh, here you go. He went all over his back. This rolled right over the top of Drake there. Drake was going for it. Oh, oh nice. Hurricane Rana from the back. Nice reverse Hurricane Rana. I think Bird hit himself a little bit, though. I think that the knee of uh, Drake was hitting him uh, on the head, too. Uh, and, and here we and go, the, hold on. Matt's back up. Oh, now he's just, he's just firing punches. elbows. Firing those elbows right in there that just floored Burt Turbo O'Neill here. Who uh -oh, is going to go to making... face? Hold on, price. hold on. Out of pasture. Out of pasture. Out, out of the pasture. pasture. Come on, count this, Drake. And now Drake hits with the leg drop. Count of one, count of two, almost a three count. Ah. Matt Asada could smell the victory. The opportunity to headline main event. Pools resting. Invasion revolution. November 29th, 5 p.m. in the epicenter here in Empire City, the newly built place where Pulse Wrestling will host their events after invasion. And now Matt Asada is just punching it away, using Drake like a punching bag. Oh, I spoke too soon. He shoves him off. Oh, oh my lord, the Basaki knee from Drake Edwards. Kicked him right in the, the face, Johnny. Right on his I don't back. know who's going to win this. It's every man's game.
keep your eye on Bert out there. We got a pin one, attempt ten, here. One, two, and three. Oh. Oh. No, 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 no. Oh, oh, oh here it comes Bert. 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 Coast to coast. Did you see that? Holy shit. Clear across the ring. It's all his height. And he splashed right onto Matt Asadazi, gunslinger. Drake is, is hurt. He's favoring the lower back of his. Still everyone's, uh, everyone's game, ladies and gentlemen. Here on Pools Wrestling. You see the triple it, threat who match. Who wants it most at this point? Who wants it most? I think at this point, it's all of them. All of them want to be uh, in the main event of Pool's Invasion. You look at the gunslinger, Matt Azadar. He is holding his midsection there in a great deal of pain. Now Drake firing into the punches. Burt firing back. They are just going back and forth here. Oh! Drake and Burt outside the ring now. What is going to happen ring. here? The sprawling. And here comes the gunslinger after them. And this match has been going on for a while, and the stamina and the injuries, the damage on the bodies of these competitors, they're really taking a toll. You can see the Drake. Oh no, my ass is going. Oh my, oh god! my god! He speared both of them into the steel steps. Oh my god! I have never seen anything like that. Holy shit! I think they're dead! I think that Asala hit his head on the stairs too! How in the hell is anybody going to get up from that? Um. The referee is checking if all three men are still are still alive. No one Neither, is moving. None of them Not have moved. An inch. Not at all. None of them have moved. Oh my Bert God. and Drake were down there by the steps and... Oh Asadar just came right at him with the spear. Oh no, the bell rang. The bell just rang. Is he counted all three of them out? No contest. Call the medics. That's your official word for the referee. He's calling the match a no contest. And he the has referee summoned medical has stopped aid. the match. The referee has called for a stoppage of the match as all three competitors are not able to to continue in this match. There's no count outs in this match. So therefore, they could have been laying here for two hours unconscious. We need medics. Well, that spear from the gunslinger, Matt Azenar, propelling all three of them right into the steel steps there. Never okay, have I ladies seen and gentlemen, like I it. understand that you wanted to see a decisive winner in this, but this is, this is not good. This is not good. We have injured, we have injured I understand still... you grief, ladies and gentlemen. I'm a little bit baffled too. But this, this is, they're not moving. They're not moving an inch. I think, I think Matt hit his head on the steel steps and he's out. And is, that was a very dangerous maneuver. What was he thinking? What the fuck was he thinking? Well, we may need to get three gurneys out here because that's what it will take to get these three out of the out of the arena. Matt Asadar single-handedly took himself out of the took took himself out of the opportunity of a lifetime and took two other competitors with him. They are still Matt all three down head off the, the floor. steps, and 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 Bert was sandwiched between him and Drake. Those three hits in the forehead and the back on the stairs. What was Matt thinking? What was he thinking? 